Hello, got a ukulele.com with a beginner's video for you. Something of an odd one. As you've probably noticed on all of my ukulele videos, there's a certain couple of passages of music that I play in every one. I always have, and the reason I do that is it allows people to compare and contrast simple stuff between the different ukuleles that I've been reviewing over the years. Um, the downside to me doing that is pretty much on every video I will get asked the question, what are those songs you play? What are the chords? How do I play them? And no amount of me replying to them, of course, that gets hidden in the comments on the videos. Um, and sometimes people ask more than once on the same video because they miss the comment. So rather than just putting something in the in introduction on every single video, uh, which would be hard work, I finally succumbed to your many requests. <laughs> and we're going to go through how to play the couple of pieces that I normally play. They're not that complicated. In fact, they're really painfully simple. Um, the strummed piece that I normally play, which goes... is the opening chords to a... I'm just going to adjust the volume here. Uh, which is the opening chords to a piece of music called Wish I Could Shimmy Like My Sister Kate. In standard open chord tuning, uh, this is a GCEA ukulele, um, and the chords to that sound complicated, but they're quite simple. So we we start with a C6, which is dead easy because there's no fretting at all, and from a C6 we go to a C sharp diminished, which is O101, so uh, second, uh, third string, first fret and first string, first fret, and the other's open. And then that goes up to a G6, which is really easy because you just move it up one fret, so you end up with O202. And then to an E7, which is 1202. And then an A add 9, or an A9, which is 0102. And then to a Hawaiian D7, which isn't really a D7, but a 2020. And then back to a G. So C6, C sharp diminished, G6, to an E7, to an A add 9, to a Hawaiian D7, to a G. It's all about the swing, so it's and that's it. C six O O O O C sharp diminished O one O one G six O two O two E seven one two O two A add nine O one O two Hawaiian D7 2020 and back to G. So it goes. And that's it. The finger picked part is really simple. It's a song called Creep by Radiohead, and I've transposed it into C, which allows you to do this sort of fiddly run up and down. Um, the first string because it starts in the chord of C and you're looking at chords C, E7, F and F minor. So a C, as you know, uh, third fret on the first string. C, everyone can play a C, easiest chord on the ukulele. But what I'm doing in that run is I'm going... So that's running up from the third to the fifth to the seventh. And then back down. And all I'm doing in that is plucking the first and the fourth strings together. So with the thumb and the first. So. C. But then running into an E7. Two. 
so C. Running it up to the 7th, then back down to the E7, straight into the E7. And then from the E7 to an F. And what I tend to do here on, when I'm playing that F is hammer the little finger onto the 3rd fret of the 1st string, just to give it that... To an F minor, which is 1013. So C, running up to the seventh, back down, E7, into an F, and remember the little finger, third fret. which aren't great, but it'll give you a feel for how that song is. When you were here before Couldn't look you in the eye You're just like an angel Your skin makes me cry You float like a feather Are the two things I play in all the videos. I'm going to put the links at the end uh, in the introduction in the bit below the video on this YouTube thing. You're going to find links to Wish I Could Shimmy Like My Sister Kate, that's the strummed bit, and a link to the chords for Creep by Radiohead. The chords on the link are actually in G, which is the natural key, but as I explain in that, it's got the lyrics and you play it in C, E7, F, F minor. Uh, if you want to play it exactly like I do on the videos, I hope that helps. Next person who asks, how do I play these chords? I'm just going to share them in this video. See you very soon. Cheerio.